Megan. Basically, I wanted to talk about how it's going with schizophrenia and relationships. I would say since I've started medicine, I won't say all my relationships have improved. I'll say I have improved. The relationships are what they are. But there are things about myself now that I know are personality quirks, and there are things about myself now I know were the mental illness. And a few things that were a little of both, I'd say. You can never separate out the mental illness from who you are and basically what you are as a person. Good person, bad person, funny person, doesn't matter. It's part of you. But I can tell that my relationships, for what makes them real, healthy, good, enjoyable, every verb and every word you can think to describe them, I am better able to respond in all the ways that I should that are healthy and good. And so far, I'd say it's possible with relationships to have very healthy, very durable, and even have many relationships that are on a very happy level. Now, you would say, when schizophrenia makes this harder? Not necessarily. You see, for me, I had to be very honest for a very long time. So I kind of got used to it. If you're honest about yourself and about your relationships and about the way things are, essentially you're as close to the truth as you can get with the way the world is, the way everything is. You can appreciate things for the way they are. That goes for your relationships. And for me, I'm better able to appreciate who I have in my life. And the schizophrenia, before I knew I had it, led me to kind of ask questions about myself, wondering what's going on, knowing now what it is. It's kind of like a little look at yourself that you're forced to take. So I get to enjoy my relationships now, I think, more than I did before. That doesn't make it easy to be around people sometimes. Annoying is annoying. You ever have family that's annoying? Then you know what I'm talking about. But I wanted to say that schizophrenia has a silver lining, I'd say, if you can work with it. I get to appreciate my relationships in all kinds of ways I never did before. And this is one of many videos, and I'm sure when it comes to relationships, I'll have many more. But seeing how many videos that other people have posted, I felt like I could need to add my own. I probably look like your average person. No one remarkable. No one you would ever remember twice, maybe passing on the street. So, I wanted to show you that schizophrenia can both hide can be out in the open, could be right in front of you, and you might not never know. And so people with schizophrenia are still just like people without schizophrenia. They just have one more little quirk about them. Thank you for listening. Comment if you enjoyed the video, and have a good day.